Oh look, there's our basement. Ugh. Three, four, five. This is gonna look very different from how our upstairs balcony looks, but we're giving it our all, which is what matters in situations like this. As long as you try your hardest, you've done well enough. Okay. We're getting lots of cotton- oh, we're getting lots of just seeds in general, that's really good, because we are actually going to have to start on farming with Botanica. Because in order to make Botanica flowers, you actually need seeds, and we have no easy way of getting them right now besides breaking tall grass. And I don't want to have to rely on breaking the grass around our house when I think it kind of looks nice. Kind of. Keyword there. So, next episode. Maybe, maybe if we're lucky in this episode, and we finish just ripping the dirt out from around our house because we're such nice nature go environment people, we will get to add whatever it's called. Okay, so do I need to go one more out? I think so. Okay, I think that's right. And now this should all be right. And now that's right, that's right, that's right. That's right, and that's right. So as long as it's one past... See, so this side isn't right. Oh, it is. And is this final side... I glitched into a chest right there. Is this side good? See, si. Okay. Espanol. Okay. I said okay a lot. Now, let's go to our building materials chest and grab some gravel. I hope we have enough gravel, because gravel is not easy to collect around... Uh, the compound because I had to dig it up from a pond and as you guys know in Minecraft when you mess with water it's so difficult to fix it because water is just very dumb in this game it's not like real water which again physics in Minecraft not always making me happy but hey it's a game it can't be perfect but yeah physics in Minecraft and water especially just, I don't like that at all not fun but yeah, so I had to harvest all this gravel from a pond. So if we don't have enough of this, we're going to have to go pond gravel mucking harvesting. Yay. Not yay. So I'm just hoping that every piece I misplace, it's not going to turn into flint because that would be bad. And we're going to have to get more. Well, we'll search our chest first, but then if there's none in there. We're gonna go gravel harvesting. How much do we need? Probably like a- There's a spider. Let's- you know what? Let's kill the spider. We have like no silk. And we got some- not silk, string. We have no string. Okie dokie. Actually, let's check in our hole. Like our little mining area to see if we have any gravel in there. Cause we may get lucky and not have to ruin another pond. Okay, we have stone, limestone, and dirt. Oh no, look at this gravel. Perfect. It was almost like it was meant to be that we were supposed to use reds. I don't like how ores. It's awesome getting diamonds, but it also freaks me out. Because I'm like, no, diamonds and redstone should not be up this high. How low did I go? How low can you go? Like, I don't know. Very good at getting distracted when I play games. It's not the easy. Oh, look, there's a cave back here. What is this? Sulfur and zinc and sandstone. Oh, cool. I know we can craft sandstone, but still, it's so much sand, and sand isn't fun to get because it has physics. See, Minecraft just can't win because I don't like it when it has right physics, and I don't like it when it has wrong physics. So it just it can't win. What are these barley seeds? Cool, fifty-six gravel. That should be about enough. Our base looks so good. I'm so happy with how it came out, and it's only getting better too, which is awesome. One, two, three, one, two, three. And I don't like how fast stacks disappear. Because it's like, you can have an inventory full of, like, clay. And it can... Oh my god, what is this? Primitive spiders? Get away from me, get away from me, get away from me. I don't even know what you are. Die. We're poisoned. What the heck? Ooh, we got unbreaking chain boots. See, that's another cool thing about bosses like that is you get cool stuff. Are we getting attacked by some? No, we're just poisoned. Okay, we need to go inside before we die. Uh, well, we almost did it. Closed door. There we go. <laughs> I don't want to die. 
I'm really... And another time, there was a creeper in the house, too. That was not fun either, because it blew up the house and I had to spend half an hour fixing it. Yeah, I would say about a quarter of the materials I collected went towards fixing the house. So, you can tell. Yeah. Oh, it looks so good. I love having the balcony like that. I mean, I know we have windows right here, but still. Oh, and also, let's explore the ship this episode. That's a real one I didn't go to. Okay, it should be safe now. And let's trim this dirt bank hill back a little bit. Just so it gives us a little bit more... Go away, zombie. Why weren't you on fire? I don't know. Yeah, let's trim this back a little bit so it doesn't feel as claustrophobic on our little gravel path. Okay, we have 19 gravel left. Are we gonna do it? One, two, three. So we have 13. Uh... No, I didn't see this area. Well, we need four more pieces of gravel. So we will just go and steal it from a pond over here. See, if we just trim the top of the gravel off, there's no, like, harm, no foul, because it's not going to mess with the water. But once you start going underwater, that's when it starts getting a bit iffy. Because then you can start messing the gravel up, and then it looks awful, and then you have to spend time trying to fix the pond, and it's almost like it would have been better if you hadn't gotten the gravel in the first place. But you, yeah, see, I have lots of issues with stuff like this. But yeah, it still bothers me how there's... I guess I can use bone meal, but still... Oh wait, let's finish our house. Base. Compound. Okay, and now let's go ahead and put dirt under these three windows. And then we will... I will... I, oh, I want to use magical flowers. That'll be cool. Okay, so now come in here and let's make some trap doors. So it's three, so we need two on each side and then three in the middle. So... We'll do the sides first, and now we need three in the middle, so one. So that'll be enough for eight, and now this will be enough for nine, and now let's make six more. I think if my head math is right enough, we should have like one extra or something. I don't know, I probably did this wrong. But hey, I tried, and that's what matters in situations like these. Okay. And then we're going to have to put torches down, and then we're going to have to put some vines down. I need to put one on the side. And then after we put the vines down, we, we're going to be done, pretty much. But we'll put the vines down and the torches down. Yeah, we had the one. Oh, wow, I did my math right. Okay, so we'll put vines and torches down, and then we will move all of our chest inside. And then, wow, we'll actually be done with our base. That's really surprising. And I know we'd get there eventually, but I didn't think it would be like, wow, we actually made progress. Here, let's just dump everything in here. I was kind of organized at one point. Not anymore. Okay, let's look for some flowers. We have lots of, not lots, we have a few red flowers. I swear some of oh, the boots are in there. Okay, actually, no, we do have quite a few red flowers. Let's go ahead and use red and blue flowers. So we'll go, we have more blue, so we'll go blue, red, blue. And then we'll go red, blue, red. And then we'll go blue, red, blue. And now we'll put, let's turn on F7 again, and we will put torches around enough so we don't have to worry about mob spawning. So we'll go ahead and put torches like that. That works. Okay, and then we'll put the two more torches here. And then here, here. Okay, and we'll just repeat this pattern around the house. Compound. God, I'm never going to learn. Just watch it be like episode 3000, and I'm still calling it the house. But by then, it'll pretty much be a house if I... That looks good. I'm very happy. Okay, let's go ahead and cut the bamboo down. And we didn't get a sprout. Oh, well, that's kind of a shame that you don't get any way to regrow it because we've cut down quite a bit of bamboo. Oh, there's a beehive over there. We'll have to go investigate that too. I didn't want to plant that. But it's kind of a shame that it's so difficult to get bamboo if you don't have like a bamboo farmer. Not a, you, you, I doubt they need you to make a farm in order to get it, but maybe. Okay, do we have any vines or do I need to go back to that little... Ruin area to collect some. 
Actually, you know, let's do it the easy way. Let's just search in any eye for vines. And then we'll open all of the chests. And if not, we will go on a field trip. Guess what, guys? <laughs> Going on a field trip. Okay. So let's go ahead and make some shears. And let's go. I should probably bring some food. See, I'm not really good at preparing. Are they in this chest? No. I thought I had some. Not really good at prepare. Bad. I'm not really good at preparing for- ooh, yeah, I also forgot, I killed an ammonite, I think it was called, when I was underwater because a skeleton shot me and I died, and yeah, so I got an ammonite empty shell, pretty cool, huh, yeah, uh-huh, okay, let's just, we'll eat the potatoes, it's fine, we have a loaf of bread and some potatoes, hello chicken, we'll pick up the egg. Wait, and we'll pick up the feathers. I love the mod that makes it so they drop stuff. It's so much better than having to, like, follow chickens around and, like, murder them. Ooh, more eggs. See, we're gonna have, like, ten eggs or somewhere close to that by the time we get back. Just because of how... What's this ruin? I don't remember seeing this one before. Oh, it's a redstone one. But we're gonna have, like, ten eggs by the time we get back just because we've been running where chickens... Feral chickens tend to live. And then, oh, maybe we'll be the first people to domesticate animals. Oh, we should have, like, a Hall of Fame. Oh, that's going to go on our to-do list. So, like, achievements list. So, I wonder what year we should call this. I know it's... I don't know what day it is. Hello, chunk boundary glitch thing. Oh, there's a... Whatever they're called down there. Mineshaft. No. Maybe we can... I doubt we'd find it. Okay, but maybe one day. Let's go ahead and gather some vines. And we'll just gather them from the bottom up. I wish you could mine them at the top and you'd get the vines, like, in between. And I still don't know what this thing is or what it does or what mod it's a part of. I'm guessing it's a part of the mod that adds ruins into the game, but you never know. So, yeah. Okay, let's pick up those vines. And now let's eat this bread. No, 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 no. And let's go back to the base. See, I said base that time. And we'll- ooh, what's type- bluebells, that's new. And that was a lax bike, but... Hello, chameleon! I still don't have melons, though. I don't know why it's so angry. I, maybe because of all these big trees. I do know that the big trees mod is notorious for causing lag spikes like that, because... It's generating these things, and the computer doesn't like having to generate giant trees. So, maybe in future eras, I won't use that mod, and I'll just use normal trees. So we don't have to worry about giant trees anymore. But yeah. Okay. Oh, there's another chicken down here. Oh, there are no eggs, though. Let's go ahead and get the white flower. Yes, there are. We get the white flower. We don't want lotuses, or loti, or whatever the plural is. Don't want dandelions. There's some pink ones around here. Let's pick up the pink ones. Okay, got all the pink ones. Anything else? No. Oh, there's an orange one. Oh, we have tons of one. Oh, whatever. May as well get it. The pigs drop eggs. I really want to have 10 eggs by the time I go back. I think that would be really fun. No, it wouldn't, but still, I want 10 eggs. I want to prove a point. It's not going to happen. What type of flowers are these? Irises. Cool. Okay, red flowers. Hi, love chicken. Oh, wait. What are. The Hello, chicken. I'm just looking for flowers. Oh, yeah. Yeah, guys. Guess you got 10 eggs. Me. Okay. Then now I can't run anymore. And I don't want to eat the potatoes. Wow, our base looks good. I'm very happy. I think it looks much better than how um it looked the first part of this video. It's improved. And I have no space for my new flowers. Okay, oh, I need those vines. Let's go ahead and dump all this stuff in there. And now we'll put down some vines. So let's put like one here, one here. And now with vines, I've come to learn that more is technically or typically less with these things just because of how when they grow, they grow down. And you think that they're not going to be a lot of them, but there end up being just tons of them everywhere so i'm just gonna put like a few around like this put some here oh let's put like one to the right of our door left of our door i know my directions i promise okay and then we'll go up on the balcony 
and we will put a few up up here. And come on the side like that, and then we'll put one like on the side there, and then on the side here. Let's put some on the side of that log, and then right there, and there. Interesting commentary, I know. We'll put one over the window. And now, we're done. Now I need to put vines up top. I'll put the last four vines up top. That'll look cool. Now I need to escape. I'm stuck. No, I'm not. We'll put one here, one here, one here, and one here. We won't have any in the front, but that's fine. And now let's rebuild. Let's go to bed. And then tomorrow morning, we will go to the shipwreck. And night-night. Okay, we have nothing in our inventory, nothing in our backpack. We'll put all of our, most of our tools. That's not the right floor. I need to write signs or something so I know which floor is which. Because until I do, I'm going to do that a lot. Okay, I need some sort of food or I'm going to die of starvation. Mm, is there anything in here that I can eat? Hmm. I don't think so. We'll make some bread. And then we'll make a boat. And then we're going to go to the ship underwater in a boat with our boat. Do I have an aisle on my woods over here? One, two, three, four, five. Put the stone bricks back. And oak wood planks to make a boat. Come on, go faster. Oh, the ship looks really cool. I wish there was a way that we could like, oh, maybe once we get the Archimedes ship mod, we'll be able to put like an airship controller on it. That would be cool. Okay. Oh, hello, Mr. Squids. Oh, is that like a castle or something over there? Man, no, it's just new chunks generating. <laughs> yeah, they're chunks, castles. No, 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 they're just chunks. Okay, what do we have here? Let's slow down and abort. Bad rain slimes. Oh, it's so dark. Okay, is there anything under here? Oh, there's an air bubble. Okay, let's escape the air bubble. See, this is where I would love dynamic lights or something to help see where everything is. Okay, I don't see anything up here. Can we mine a little hole? No, obviously not. And we're going to start drowning. Let's go back to our air bubble. Whew, okay. Is there anything up here at all? Or is this a waste of time? I don't see anything... Oh, look at this. Can we get the air bubble? Come on. What is this? Oh, well. We're already gonna drown. And we drowned. Yay! Okay. Well, next time, guys, we're gonna go back and get our stuff. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll go back. <laughs>